Hello everyone. Welcome back to Lynn Homestead. Have you ever had a problem with stumps? This stump, I cut this tree down, I believe about four years ago, maybe in five. I used a combination, I tried to use a gas chainsaw, and um, it just wouldn't run right. Couldn't get it to run right. I didn't want to cooperate. Mind you, this is three stumps in one. So after I burnt down, I tried to cut it down a little bit more. And what I wanted to do was burn the stump down. Started a fire here, let it burn. Ten times would not burn. I drilled the full holes. All the stumps here. Been trying to get rid of all these years. And they just, this one won't burn. I figured that one ain't going to burn. And that one over there is not going to burn. So I got stump removal. Mix it up, put it in there. Nothing. Absolutely nothing. A stump that doesn't burn. Charred it really well. So here it's been sitting. I've, oh, I've even dumped muriatic acid in it. Nothing. So, we're going to use my little craftsman, my replacement 10 inch chainsaw. I didn't have any bar oil. Only thing I had was tractor hydraulic fluid. Oil is oil. Let's see if it will cut through this stump because I would really like to get rid of it. I, yes, I could go rent me a stump grinder, but that cost money. On a homestead, we, you would like to try to save as much as you can because there's other projects to be done. I am a, a pre-senior citizen. I'm going to be 61, I believe, uh, Thursday of this week. And um, I kind of want to save what little money I have so I can do other things here on the homestead and show you. Yeah, I'm sure I messed up on the chicken run, but that's okay. I still have a way to anchor it. It's going to be a little challenging because of the uh, the kennel, for some unknown reason, is kind of bowed. But you know what? I got a plan. Let's see what this baby can do. Like cutting through concrete. But it's cutting. Not very much, but it is cutting. think this thing's made of stone. Let's try to make another cut here.
take a look at the uh, chips here. They almost look like walnuts, you know? Remembering the tree, it was white on the outside and it was just dark. Dark, almost black on the inside. Let me know in the comments what kind of tree you think this was. I mean, it didn't really look like an oak tree, but it didn't have walnuts on it. I remember it had poison oak running up it, or could have been poison, uh, yeah, it would have been poison oak. It was uh, poison vines. So let's try to cut at a diagonal here and see if we can't cut some of these chunks out and see what this stump looks like. Let's check the chain. Now still kind of sharp. Let me get on the other side here. Letting the chain do the work. I'm not pressing down on it. wood. I know I didn't have a maple leaf. And this is just all the time. All the time. I mean, look at this. This is in the heart. 
deep red. I swear this thing is just petrified. Try to get this big piece out. I know it dolls the chain like nobody's business. This chain's done already. Got it. I think. God, I, I just wish I can get rid of the stupid stump. There we go more. Chain is very dull at this point. Very dark red in here. So, what do you think this is? Very dark red. This, this thing doesn't burn. It doesn't matter what you do, it just does not burn. And it dulled the chain on this saw. It gets oiled. Every chain, this stump ever touches, it dulls the chain. I don't think even a stump grinder would go through that. But anyways, that's what I want to show in this video. 20 volt, 10 inch chainsaw versus hardwood stump. Will it cut it or will it dull it?